Hey guys. Hi. It feels like. Hi guys. It feels like forever since I've done a video. How are you guys doing? It's your favorite girl, Victoria Fash. Welcome back to another video. Yes, I know I'm looking like I'm looking like. <laughs> How are you guys doing so today is friday i was already supposed to be i was supposed to be in texas today i already i ought to have landed earlier today is it today or yesterday yeah i ought to have landed today yeah so i had to cancel my flights due to some issues and at a point i thought this trip was already cancelled i thought i would be able to make it but oh my god god bless stanka stanka she's the <laughs> you guys know my friends balaji and christy so stanka is um she's balaji's elder sister she's always been seeing every time i come to the u.s this lady hmm, one day one day i will tell the story of how god has used this lady for me multiple times i cannot even i cannot see i cannot <laughs> anyway so i am traveling to texas which is exciting um whew, i also have i like i said i canceled the flight but and i didn't think i was gonna go but this time around i have to go the flight has been rebooked and i will be leaving from washington dc tomorrow morning by my flight takes off by 8 30 a.m right <laughs> and the 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 distance between my house and dc is two hours <laughs> right so a friend of ours will be picking us up tomorrow a colleague rather in my class she will be picking me up tomorrow morning around 4 a.m. So we should set out around 4.30 tomorrow so that we can get to the airport in time. My friend Tanya, uh, I don't think you guys have seen Tanya. Yeah, you have. If you watched the last video I did, the Christmas party, Tanya is the tall lady. So she's also traveling. So we'll both be traveling tomorrow, which is exciting, um, especially because of the kind of week i've had everybody around me has been like you have to go for this trip you need to go for this trip so anyways i'm taking to their advice because left to me i won't leave i won't go anywhere and stanka has been like you are coming like you are coming it's now more than ever but yeah so i started to pack my stuff um i'm also hoping that i would have moved out of here by um january i'm actively looking for someone to take over this place um more details will follow later <laughs> not now um so yeah so i need to also try to pack up everything well not everything i cannot pack up everything just pack up a few things so that when i'm actually leaving i will just pack up a few like other few things yeah so yeah that's what i'm going to do now so you guys that's what this video is about this video is just packing 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 mm -hmm. so as you can see uh that is that box is staying that's a very mighty box this is my second box that i came with it's over here yeah from nigeria can you guys see the box i'm oh, sorry i have to see so this box is where the box i'm taking along um i won't be going with my light but i'll be going with my tripod uh what else <sighs> i need to pack up i need to pack up i've gone to the kitchen to clear out my stuff there i made spaghetti to eat and i've eaten and i've become tired right so i need to pack up my entire wardrobe make sure there's nothing left there and then pack up what i'll be taking to travel i'll be gone for i'll be gone till next year i live here so just i'm by the time you're seeing this video i'm already there so praying to god for journey mercies it's three hours flight guys oh my god i can't believe i'll be on the air for three hours tomorrow but yeah i'll be on the air for three hours it's a three hours flight to austin texas i've heard so much about austin so i'm excited to see especially because this town is now a ghost town so harrisonburg where i live is literally built around the university so whenever there is break it's almost like you're in a ghost town because every single person lives harrisonburg so so when school is not in session like now you will hardly see anybody around yeah so 
that's what is happening now so i'm excited to go to a place where life is happening okay so don't let me talk too much i have a lot to do so let us get parking <laughs> oh one thing if you don't one thing i just want to leave with you guys is we need there's a message i'm listening to by joshua seman i was actually listening to it again just now um it's called times and seasons i don't know if you guys can see this so it's called times and seasons <sighs> see it's good to be sensitive to the spirit because to be honest god speaks god speaks if only we are we are attentive to hear when he starts to speak to you oh my god sometimes it is set up and god really set me up big time this week <laughs> but i am so glad that we serve a god that speaks god speaks right so that's the comfort i have don't let me talk too much let us get packing okay <laughs> i have to put this on the stand Hi guys so I just finished I just finished packing so that those are that's the box going no that one is staying this one is going this small one is staying at Mercy's place um, yeah so I'm done packing I've messaged Mercy to come and pick me up but I want to go to the kitchen and pack up the spaghetti I made I think I'm going to have that tonight. Uh, what else? That's it, really. So I was watching some of my videos, my videos in Nigeria early this morning. And honestly, it made me realize how much, you know, sometimes we can be so short-sighted when we are in a particular season of our life and we are in such a hurry to leave that season because we ju we're just waiting for the next big thing right many of us especially as christians I, I don't even think as christians as human beings we live for the next big thing what's the next thing god what's the next season what do you have for me that we don't really take time to enjoy the season that god has us in now because we are always looking forward to what's next what's next right so i was watching that video <laughs> my hand is spinning me i was watching some of the videos on my channel and some of the vlogs i made um by the way if you've not watched if you don't if you didn't know me before i came to the u.s you don't know me at all <laughs> you don't know me at all anyways so um 
So I was watching some of those videos and I was just reminiscing and there's a place for Thanksgiving, right? I, I don't think I wasted in, in those seasons of my life. There were just seasons where, you know, and I think I was so proud of myself because there were videos that I made where we were joking, having fun, laughing and all of that. You know, me and my husband, I was watching particular vlogs that had me and my husband and vlogs that were just happy but really behind those smiles we were going through a lot as a family but I'm so glad that we did not allow that season to overwhelm us and steal our joy. We're still able to enjoy, you know, the season whilst we go through the season so i don't know what you might be going through right now because if there's anything i've learned about life is life will always show up okay life will always show up and life will hmm no matter what season you're looking at if you're looking at the next thing you know you're relocating or you're getting married or you're having kids when you get there you'll find it's that that season has its own challenges right um, but look for the joy in the season and enjoy it. Enjoy the moment because once it's gone, it's gone. I'm listening to this message and it's really making me to really think about times and season and how life doesn't wait for anyone. Okay, time will move. <laughs> right and you know sometimes you move into the next thing that you think that is the next big thing for you and you realize that oh my god can i go back the way i was not really because because you realize that there are a lot of things that you didn't appreciate then that now you you cannot go back to it anymore so yeah enjoy your moment okay my battery is about to go off i think i'm going to end the vlog here there's really nothing else to do to show i just need to pack my camera and make sure that i don't forget anything and tomorrow early morning we are heading out and i have assignments to submit today so i need to deal with that but anyways thank you guys for watching the next i don't know if it's this video then i'm sure it's continuing will be me heading to the airport okay all right guys bye
my face in this vlog and I am not about to do that I'm just about to have dinner yeah